Hey, hey, I'm Jazz Kone, and we lit this motherfucking way. Like I always tell you, look this way. You know it. Just see the proof is in the pudding. Your girl ain't got it. Explain. If you're new to my channel, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and turn on your post notifications so you will not miss a video with your girl. Uh -oh. Anywho, I've been trying to pick back up the ball of consistency for YouTube because it's hard for me a little bit. I do get a little lazy, but lately I have been feeling sick. See, I thought it was COVID, but your girl didn't have COVID over. I don't know what your girl had, but I tested negative for COVID. I tested negative for strep throat. I tested negative for everything. Y'all, my throat was hurting. My head was hurting. Nose was running. I was sneezing. I had diarrhea. My arms and legs was getting weak on me. And like my throat was hurting so bad, I couldn't swallow. I couldn't barely talk. Everything just hurt, and it was just throbbing in my sleep. And I was like, what is going on? And when they told me it wasn't COVID, it made me even more worried. Because I'm like, what? Well, I'm thankful that I did not have COVID, and I'm thankful that I'm feeling better now. So, your girl is back in front of the camera now, and we got a ball to make, y'all. We got a motherfucking video to show. This is so time about the first time your girl got. <laughs> but, anywho, this is the story time about the time your girl first got high. Her first, my first time ever getting high. Let's get into this video. So this particular day, this particular day, y'all girl woke up and around this time, y'all, I did not like when my boyfriend, he was then my boyfriend, I didn't like when he was smoking weed. It irked my nerves. Like, I just did not like it for some reason. I didn't like to see people smoking weed. And even I had a boy best friend named JB and he had asthma. He was smoking weed. I used to hate it. So I used to stay on JB and my boyfriend's butt about stopping that nasty trait, what I called it back then. And like, I just did not like it. And I don't know why. I remember one day, y'all, I went, the first time I found out my boyfriend smoked weed, he posted a video on Instagram blowing the smoke out. And I'm like, so I text him, babe, what are you doing? What was that video that I just seen on Instagram? And he like, what like that video I just sent you post on Instagram, you was blowing smoke out your mouth. Was it a cigarette? He like, I want me like I smoke cigarettes. I'm like, I'm hoping it ain't no crack. I'm hoping it ain't crack. Let's say the smartness. <laughs> but he was like, it's weed. So y'all, then that's when I found out he was actually selling it too. So I'm just seeing the weed and him just smoking. It just was irking my nerves. I used to hate it, y'all, and I do not know why. The day that I started smoking weed, it was actually, um, I woke up one day and he kept saying, I need some weed, I need some weed, I need some weed. And I was like, no, you don't. You need to stop smoking that stuff. Leave that stuff alone. You don't have to keep doing that stuff. He was like, okay, okay, okay. How about you smoke one time with me and see how it is for yourself. And then after that, I'm done smoking. Gullible, y'all. I was so gullible back then. I believed in that. I was like, you for real? He was like, yeah. I was like, pinky promise. The pinkies was promising. He was like, I promise. And so, okay. Right this time, the street, the store was right down the street from us. So we walked to the store and got some guards. And then somehow he winded up finding somebody to sell him sweets. We went back to the house and we went back in the room. Around this time, we had a toddler. So we made our toddler go in the room with my brothers. And it was me and him back there in the room and he began to roll up the weed. And I was sitting there like really trying to learn why do people smoke this little plant? I'm like, why do people be breaking, smoking them little bushes down? They look like you supposed to saute it on some butter, season it up real good and it tastes like broccoli. He was like, so this how you break the weed down? He was really showing me how to do stuff. I was like, you ain't got to show me this because we ain't going to never do it again, remember? He was like, I know it's just in case you feel like you want to keep going after me. He's like, why would I feel like that? I'm not. He finished rolling up the blunt. And then he lit it up, but he let me hit it first. Y'all, my first time smoking weed, I smoked loud. When it's your first time smoking weed, don't smoke no loud. That stuff is strong. I smoked loud. It didn't do nothing bad to me, but I could not stop laughing, y'all. I could not control my laughter. I lit that thing up and I took my first puff. <sighs> y'all, when I say my throat was on fire and my chest was burning, I was like, <laughs> It's supposed to do me like this. 
she was like, that's how I do it. And then I couldn't stop coughing. He hit it like, we, we was just passing the blood back and forth in rotation. And before I knew it, I was higher than a motherfucker. I felt like I was floating. And I couldn't stop laughing. And I was hungry as hell. I just had the urge to eat anything. I saw a shoestring on the floor. And that shoestring looked delicious. I wanted to eat anything. So he went and got us some chicken from Southern Classic. Southern Classic was also right up the street from us. When he went and got the chicken, he came back. He actually came back with some daiquiris too. Now, if y'all know anything about cross... Cross something. It's called cross when you get high and drunk at the same time. It's not a good mix. You already dizzy from from the drink and stuff. And then you high. It's, it's not a good mix. So I'm sipping my daiquiri. My boyfriend actually had bust my cup and wasted all my daiquiri. So I didn't get to get drunk and high. But I was high as hell. But him on the other hand, he was drunk and high. And he wound up throwing up his chicken that he ate. And he had another piece that he started eating on the pulled the hot sauce on, but he didn't get to finish it because he fell right to sleep because he was messed up. Me, on the other hand, I was literally y'all crashed over him laughing. I was crashed over this man laughing in his face, eating his chicken that he didn't finish. That day, after my high went down, I was like, damn, now I want to do it again. Damn, now I want to do it again. Went back there and asked him, can we, can we do it one more time just to make sure you, just because we need to make sure you get it all out your system. We need to make sure that you don't want to do it again. <laughs> you know, I'm doing this for you. This is for you because I love you. He's like, yeah, we can do it again. So he wound up the another batch. Cha-cha-cha. He wound up another batch and we do it again. And y'all, the feeling, it just felt so... I felt like I was a bird that could fly. I felt like I was a bird that could fly. I felt like I was that bird that could fly. I felt like that bird that could fly. I... I felt like that bird that could fly. I felt like that bird that could fly. Ever since then, I have been hooked on weed until your girl got laced with something and then it almost killed me and my boyfriend, uh, well, my husband. And then I, after that, I had bad anxiety about smoking weed and I stopped. Then I recently just started back this year smoking CDB or CBD, however it's called. That calms you down. That's something I just started back smoking, but I'm really not heavy on it. I smoke it every blue moon. But that was a little quickie, little story time by the time you girl smoke the weed, you know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? Anywho, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and turn your post notifications so you not miss a video. And if you want to be a part of the league gang, make sure you cut, you subscribe, boom. Subscribe because we live over here. We live over here. I don't know where we're all at. And thank y'all so much for making my second, my I Masturbated in Class Part 2 go viral like the first one. The first one is at 19K something, I believe. And then the second one, in three days, it was at 400 and some views. Y'all know my videos don't usually do numbers like that. So your girl was excited. Your girl was stoked. <laughs> But anywho, thank y'all for tuning to this video. I'm Jessica Day, and I'll see y'all in another video. Bye, Lee Gang. Peace.